Good afternoon everybody, this is Nel Coroco again and this is Dialax Evo 11 update continuation. Okay, so remember this Dialax regular, the red one, the old version. If you want to open those luminaires, you just need to click this button and then you will easily see those luminaires on and all the fittings and the photometric curves are there, those yellows. And you can now do that in Dialax Evo 11. So how to do that? Say this is my example. This is a control room. And say for example, I want to open one luminaire only or select one luminaire. I can just see it like this. And the old versions, uh, it, the old version of Dialax Evo, you need to grab it all together or you need to go to the light scene to select all those uh, inside or out, uh, indoor luminaires to grab all those fittings but here in the Lux Evo 11 it's very easy now because they upgraded the version and all you need to do is click one tab again similar to the Dialux Evo Red uh, sorry the Dialux Regular or the Dialux Red and you can find that one here in this display button and click this little uh, lights here and see, you can see that selected luminaire. Yes, this is the default. And if you do that, you can just select the luminaire, right? But if you click this one, the little arrow here, and click the all luminaires, look at this. Boom! Isn't it gorgeous? Yeah, it's amazing. And if you go to the plan view, yes, you can see it right there. And you cannot see those red lines like when you grab it all together. It's definitely similar to the Dialux, uh, the Dialux Red. Like turn on and then turn off and then turn on. Okay, so that is how you also do it, do it in Dialux Evo 11. Okay, and there you go. So the difference is uh, the photometric curve is blue uh, rather than yellow. Okay, so this is the update for the Dialux Evo 10. Later on, the Dialux team will upload it and you can download for free. And I have one question in uh, my Udemy course. This is related to this one. This is from Nabham AM. And then he asked me, all light shows visualization on the same time in clicking in one luminaire. How to visualize only one light? Okay, this is the problem with the Dialux Evo because let's go to the conference room. Say for example, I want to select only one luminaire and if I want to open it, this uh, show light visualization, let's go and uh, cancel the, can the calculation first. And say for example, I want to check only this down light. Yes, it's supposed to be like that. But it seems that this Dialux Evo 11 is now opening also those luminaires close to this down light that I selected. Again, let's try this, the middle one. See, even those cove lights are also included in the visualization. What if we go outside and check this one flood light, what it, what it will be look like? So for example, I want to check this one. See, I selected only this flood light but it seems that the down lights on the doorway also open. Look at this one. See, nothing is there. But if I select this one, yeah, even the uh, floodlight close to it has also open. Now this time it's only those down lights on the, the window, but this one is closed. But if I selected this one, see, it's now open here. So it seems that there is a radius for... Uh, the, the luminar or the light visualization for this Dialux Evo 11 and you cannot select one luminar only to show it up like before like remember when we try to aim um, it's going rotated we want to aim those luminar yeah you can only see those fittings before the earlier version of Dialux Evo but now I think they um, change it or I think something is changed really on this one because you can now see all those luminaires close to that uh, selected fitting. Yeah, we may ask again the Dialux team 
to return this, the original uh, luminaire or light visualization to change it into one fitting visualization rather than a group or um, a radius or a, a, a circumfer circumference of a luminaire or the surrounding luminaires are also included in the visualization. So for example, I want to open this one. So it should be only this wall-mounted luminaire, but again, you can see those floodlights are also on. Okay, and let's say, for example, I want to open this floodlight on the perimeter fence. Even this one, this is so far from the structure now, but it looks like it is also open. How about this one? Yeah, look at this. It's also connect. Seems like it's also connected on that part. But you can see it's too far from each other now. So, yes, um, for uh, those dialogue team, may we request again to return the single visualization for one luminaire rather than a group of fittings or luminaires. Okay, so that's it. And I hope you learned some techniques today again. Again, let's go and check this one. Very good. Look at that. And if it's only single choice or single selection, yes, go and select it. Or just select this one. Alright, so see you again on the next video. And don't forget, if you want to enroll my Udemy course, go and check the advanced course in the basic and the other lighting design courses. And don't forget to subscribe. See you again on the next video.